Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to either enable or disable the Windows Update Status Notification icon that appears in the taskbar. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward process here guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So first thing we're going to do is open up the Start menu. Just off click on the Start button one time. Type in Reg Edit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match to go back a red sheet editor. You want to right click on that and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to go left click on yes. Now before you proceed in the registry, I would highly suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything went wrong, you could easily restore it back. So pretty straightforward process of how to create the backup. It's just left click on the file tab. Select export. File name, I would suggest naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Export range should be selected to all, and then save it to a convenient location on your computer, and then just select save. And if you ever need to import it back in, just would select file import. Again, very straightforward process. So once you've done that, now you are ready to begin, and we're going to start by expanding the H key local machine folder. So either double click on it or left click on the little arrow next to it to expand the drop down. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Same thing for Microsoft. Same thing for Windows Update, so you're going to have to scroll down a little bit. Expand that. Now there should be something that says UX. Expand that. And now there should be a Settings folder in here. Go ahead and just left click on that. Now on the right side, you want to create a new D word value. So right click on a blank area, select New, and then select D word 32 bit value. You want to call this Tray Icon visibility exactly as it appears on my screen so tray icon visibility the first letter of each should be capitalized and there should not be any spaces in between any of this so t-r-a-y i-c-o-n v-i-s-i-b-i-l-i-t-y hit enter on your keyboard to save that and value data should be zero by default. You can go ahead and double click on it just to be sure. And again, it says zero in here. Select OK. And now if you ever wanted to re-enable Windows Update Tray Notifications, you could just delete this D word value by right clicking on it and then selecting delete. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.